Pop quiz. When is the best time to change something about your technique? Certainly not the day of a competition or the day of a big one rep max back squat. Imagine a back squat. You already are nervous. Oh, this is a weight I've never done before. Have I done enough? Am I going to be successful? There's so many things you're going through your mind already. The last thing you need to be thinking about is, oh, what was that thing I needed to do with my back? What? No. The best time to do it is so far removed from a one rep max that it can actually get ingrained into your technique without you having to think about it. How long? For some people, it's months. Some people, it's weeks. It's certainly not days, okay? If you're thinking, hey, three months from now, I'm going to try to do a one rep max back squat, great. When you're doing your lighter repetitions, maybe it's a deload, maybe you're completely pivoting away from a season of something, that's the exact time you want to be doing something new with your technique, or at least playing around with your technique. You may find, ah, that wasn't quite right, or wow, I hurt my rib in my last program. I need time to figure out what happened. Whatever it is, do it as far away as you can. That way, the next time you PR, you can worry less about this technique that you implemented and more about, oh my god, am I going to shit myself?